What up everyone? This is the Comic Outlaw coming to you live and loud from places unknown. For my own little slice of heaven. And uh usually I try to talk about the past or things that happen. I try to keep things a little less current, but I got a compliment on Batman fifty and the wedding of Batman, which I find to be an interesting story. I mean Bruce being happy is a great conundrum. Can Batman really be happy? Batman always teeters on the side of good, but deep down in his heart leans more towards us than anything else. It's that misery, that pain, that suffering that makes him who he is. He's that little boy who lost his world in that alley. And nothing he can do to ever get that back. We can make sure that it never happens again. He's the knight, the vengeful soul that goes out over and over again. No matter what pain it causes to him, the demon that comes out of hell, bringing every victim forth. Everyone that he can save, everything that he believes, everything that he holds dear, he holds in Gotham. His heart. In his soul. It's part of the pain and misery that he suffers. It sort of reflects Gotham's own broken heart. That's what makes Batman part of Gotham. That's what makes Gotham part of Batman. They both have that broken heart, that broken soul, that broken ability inside of them that. lost little part of them that they can't seem to find and they can only fill with moments of justice moments of retribution and vengeance and maybe that's all Batman is fear personified but I still find hope he finds hope for a better day a better tomorrow or a world to live Without Batman, without masked men, without painted beings wandering back and forth. That simple, simple idea of being able to retire in a kingdom that's good and has its happily ever after. But Batman is Gotham's broken heart. And it's funny that Selena did leave him, spoilers, I should say. Miss Lena left him at that altar. And I don't know if it's a permanent thing. We'll see if it is. I kind of doubt it, but we'll see. Because love is a powerful thing. Love is a promise. And love is what you're willing to put up with and what you're willing to let go of. And maybe she let go of him for all of Gotham City so that he can save Gotham from its pain and maybe he has to suffer in order for Gotham to be saved maybe it's a different kind of love maybe she was just scared and needed to walk away but still fear always seems to come into play in the world of Bruce doesn't it doesn't it but that's just my thoughts on the wedding issue. This is the Comic Outlaw. Hit me up anytime, anywhere. I'll send you a reply. Catch you on the flip side. See you later.